analysis of algorithms, asymptotic notations. We shall work out more problems in uh, finding out the complexity of various uh, algorithms. So here, for question number one, find out the time complexity of the algorithm given by the recursion, recurrence formula Tn is equal to 1 when n is equal to 0. Otherwise, Tn is equal to T of n minus 1 plus 1 for all the values of n greater than 0. So we start with the formula. Tn is equal to T n minus 1 plus 1. Now we have to substitute therefore T n minus 1 again. So it becomes, as you know, T n minus 1 is equal to T n minus 1 minus 1 plus 1. So it becomes t n minus 2 plus 1, then it comes to plus 1. So this, uh, here we substitute the value again, or this becomes t n minus 1. So where there is n, you substitute by n minus 1, and then the whole formula is repeated. So it becomes therefore t of n minus 2 plus 2, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Then it becomes t n minus 3 plus 1 plus 2, then that is plus 3. It goes on like that. So you come to a uh, place where it becomes T n minus k plus, plus k. So this 3 plus 3 minus 3 plus 3 minus k k. It is going to be k at this position when the value here of this number becomes k. So if k is equal to n, what happens? Then it becomes T n is equal to T n minus 1 and n minus n plus n that is equal to t of 0 plus n and you know t of 0 when n is equal to 0 it is 1 so it becomes 1 plus n t n is, has been simplified to 1 plus n therefore what is the uh, time complexity of this so time complexity of t n is equal to of the order of n plus 1 simplified it is of the order of n so a formula like Tn is equal to T of n minus 1 plus 1 uh, is converted into 0 of big O of n, big O of n, that is the complexity of this recurrence formula. Let us, now same recursion formula, let us put it in terms of the function. As you see here, function, the same thing is represented here by the function. So here Tn, it is Tn and here you have got is n is equal to 0, it is 1. That is the terminating condition. Otherwise, you print first, print 3, then it becomes tn minus 1, print 2, then print 1, then it comes to n is equal to 0, therefore it prints uh, one, yeah, uh, 1. So 1, 1. Therefore, how, what is the value? 3, 3, 1, 2, 3, plus 1. So it is 3 plus 1. In other words, it is n plus 1 and that is the answer for the same question. The same uh, problem was given in terms of a recurrence formula and uh, the, uh, uh, in terms of a function. Find the time complexity for the algorithm represented by the following recurrence. As you see here, that is tn is equal to 1 if n is equal to 1. Otherwise, T, n, t of n is equal to 2 tn by 2 plus n for all the values of n greater than 0. So again, we take this formula. Tn is equal to 2 into 2 into t of n by 2 plus n. Now we have to substitute tn by 2. So tn by 2 again is going to be, as you see, 2 into tn by 4 because you have to divide by 2 plus n plus n. So this remains the same here. This one is substituted by uh, this formula again. So it becomes 2 square plus t uh, into t of n by 4 plus 2n plus n is equal to 2n. So it becomes uh, equal to, uh, again, what is t of n by 4? That is equal to 2t of n by 8. That is n by 4 divided by 2 is n by 8 plus n again plus 2n. So it becomes therefore 2 to the power 3 of into t of n by 8 plus 3n. So let us now go on till the value of this in a number becomes k. So for k therefore it becomes 2 to the power k into t n divided by 2 to the power k. As you see here 2 to the power 3 is what is equal to 8. Therefore 2 to the power k 
we substitute this number by 2 to the power k plus k into n. 3 is k, therefore k into n. This becomes the general formula for this equation. Now let us start, still simplify. So if t 2 to the power k is n, what happens? Then it, this formula becomes equal to n into t uh, n by n plus n k. You substitute therefore uh, that is uh, uh, 2 to the k, n uh, value for 2 to the power k. So that is what we are doing here. So then that is, for example, therefore, if 2 to the power k is equal to n, suppose you take log to the base 2, what happens? Therefore, it becomes k is equal to log of n to the base 2 or we just put it as log 2. So k has become log n. So let us substitute, therefore, n into t to the power 1 plus n k is equal to log n. So n log n. Now two to t1 is equal to 1. So it will become n plus n log n. Therefore, the complexity of this recurrence formula is going to be uh, of the order or big O of n plus n log n. Since n log n is greater than n, we just put it as big O of n log n. So this is the answer for this uh, uh, complexity of this recurrence formula. We take up one more example. Here we have got a function. We have to convert this function into a recurrence formula. How do we do that? So first, so if n is equal to 1, it is going to be 1 over that. Otherwise, what happens? As you see here, so we consider as t of n. t of n is what? t of n is equal to, in, in 1, we, uh, we don't bother about this 1. So we consider this. So it is going to print i n times. Therefore, it is n times it is going to do. Then it comes again to t to the power n by 2. That is recursion. Therefore, that is t of n by 2, t of n by 2. So putting all these things together. So if t n is equal to 1, if n is equal to 1 here, otherwise it is going to be 2 t of n by 2 plus n plus n here, plus n is there. So as you see how a uh, function has been converted into a recurrence formula and you should be able to solve this recurrence formula. We have already done that and get the uh, complexity of this uh, function and it happens to be of the big order of n log n. We have solved it earlier. So you try it again. Now we come to prove that the complexity of the following recurrence relationship is of uh, big uh, O of n log n. So we consider this Tn is equal to 2n minus 1 plus log n this time. For all values of n greater than 0, it is going to be 1 for n is equal to 0. So let us take this formula. So Tn is equal to Tn minus 1 plus log n. Now we have to substitute this. Tn minus 1 is going to be Tn minus 2 plus log n minus 1. So wherever there is a, a n here, you substitute by n minus 1. Therefore, it becomes n minus 1 minus 1, n minus 2. The log in n is n minus 1 value. Therefore, log becomes log n minus 1. This is the original log n. So that is equal to T of n minus 2 plus log n minus 1 plus log n. Again, this one, again, substitute here. It becomes T of n minus 3 plus log of n minus 2 plus log the original one, n minus 1 and log n. So it goes on like that. We come to a value of k uh, for this integer. So if it is T of n minus k, naturally it is going to be log of n minus k minus 1 log of n minus k minus 2 up to going up to log n as you see here. Yeah. So what is this one? So that is if k is equal to n therefore what happens to this? This becomes 0. This becomes this cancels here. k is equal to n therefore log 1, log 2, log 3, log n minus 1 and log n, log n it becomes. So, so simplifying that the t of 0 is equal to 1 then log n, log 2, log 3 uh, plus log n minus 1 log n. As you know, uh, 1 into log of 1 into 2 into 3 into etc. is going to be log, one, log of 1 plus log of 2, log of 3, etc. So this could be simplified as therefore 1 plus log of 1 into 2 into 3 into up to n. Now what is this? This is nothing but factorial of n. So 1 plus factorial of n. So therefore, this recurrence formula is becomes 1 plus log of n factorial. 
Now we simplified this one log of n factorial as n log n because the value of, uh, uh, as you see here, n factorial is less than n to the power n. So it's therefore taking log, therefore, log of uh, n factorial is equal to n log n. So we can substitute, therefore, since this is bigger than this, we can substitute this formula here in uh, uh, the formula above. So therefore, now we take the complexity, and the complexity of t of n is equal to big O of n log n. It is big O of 1 plus n log n. We remove that one. It is a constant. Therefore, no problem. So it becomes n log n. Okay. We will come to one more. Prove that the complexity of the following recurrence relationship is big O of n. Again, we do the same way. So we have got uh, tn is equal to t of n by 2 plus n this time, not 1. We have done already with the 1. So let us see. So that is equal to therefore substitute again. Therefore, tn by 4 plus n by 2 plus n it becomes because you are substituting n by 2 here in this the, and put it here within brackets. Therefore, it becomes n by 4. The n by 2 divided by 2 is n by uh, 4 and n becomes n by 2 plus. So again, that is equal to t of n n divided by 2 square, 4 is equal to 2 square plus n by 2 plus n. So let it go on, it becomes therefore, this becomes therefore uh, t of n divided by 2 to the power 3 because you are dividing it by 2 and again this becomes n divided by 2 to the power 2. Then, then this becomes n by 2 and n. So this goes on like this till you say or let, let to this uh, integer value be k. So this is n divided by 2 to the power k. Naturally, this is going to be n divided by 2 to the power k minus 1. As you see there, 3, 2, 1. So therefore, it is k. It has to be 1 less. It goes on like this. n 2, n, uh, two squared, 2 and n. So that is equal to t of n divided by 2 to the power k plus we remove that n outside and within brackets it becomes 1 divided by 2 to the power k minus 1, k minus 2, etc. 1 by 2 squared that is 4 plus 1 by 2 is 0. 0.5 plus 1. So that is, so if 2 to the power k is equal to n, then what happens? This formula is simplified into t of n by n plus n into all this number, all this number. And you note that 1 plus 0.5 plus 0.25 goes on. So it is almost equal to 1. It is almost equal to 1. Therefore, we say, therefore, it is 1 plus 1, 1 plus 1. So that is, this is t of n, 1, n by n is equal to 1. Therefore, it is 1 plus 2n. Therefore, the complexity is going to be of Tn is equal to of the order or big O of 1 plus 2n is equal to order of n. So that is the answer for this problem. With that, I have got a few formulas which will help you to solve some of these recurrence, recurrence formulae which we have already used. So already we have used, for example, in the earlier example, last session, S is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 3 is the sum of natural numbers is given by a formula equal to n into n plus 1 divided by 2. For example, I have got, a, I want to find out the sum of 5 natural numbers. It is 15. How do I get 5 into 5 plus 1 divided by 2? 5 into 6 by 2 is equal to 15. So this is a simple uh, formula to find out the sum of n natural numbers. Here you have got again n is equal to 2 to the power k. So taking log, log into the base 2 becomes k, k. So this is also we have just now we have used it very helpful and one more formula which we have already uh, familiar with. So log of uh, n factorial is equal to n log n. Why we said because n factorial less than n to the power n therefore we say it is almost equal to n log n. Then we have got one more formula here. Uh, s is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 2 squared. Is that this is 2 to the power 0, 2 to the power 1, etc., 2 to the power k. So what is the sum of these? Sum of these is very simple. We have come across this formula again when we studied tree, the depth of the tree or the total number of uh, uh, nodes in a binary search tree. And if there, if it is h is the height or the depth of the tree, then we say it is 2h plus 1 minus 1, same thing here, 2k plus 1 minus 1. So that gives me the sum of the 
2k 2 to the power k uh, numbers of uh, 2. So this is an example here. 2 to the power 3 is equal to 1 plus 2 plus 8 here. That is 15. That is equal to 2 to the power 4 minus 1, 16 minus 1. Therefore, that is therefore that is this. S is equal to 2 to the power k plus 1 minus 1. Now here are summary of some of the complexities of some of the recurrence formula. Follow it will be helpful for you to answer uh, MCQs. So t to the power uh, t n is equal to t n minus one plus one. It is of the order of n, big O of n. If it is one, it is n. So I use the same formula, but use instead of one you have got n. Therefore it becomes n squared. Here in this case it is log n. Therefore n into log n of the order of n log n. There is n squared is then the natural is going to be big O of n3. That is n cubed. So easy to remember therefore. We take one more example here. Tn is equal to n minus 2. This was n minus 1. n minus 2 plus 1. That is also of the order of n. And here n minus any number plus n. So it is already n into n. Therefore it is n squared. So please remember these integers could be any number. Then the corresponding uh, complexity is going to be in terms of this number. If it is 1, it is n. If it is n, it is n squared. Just multiply by n. So that is what you are going to do. And here one more. This is a recurrence formula again. Tn is equal to 2 into Tn minus 1 plus 1. So that is 2 to the power n of the order 2 to the power n. If it is 3, therefore, it is 3 to the power n. If it is 2 uh, and uh, t n minus 1, there is 2 to the power n into n, n. So, therefore, n into 2 to the power n. So, this summarizes some of the complexities of our algorithms which we have studied. So, very good. Thank you very much.